Hello, everybody. Welcome to episode four of All the Mods 9 to the Sky, uh, where we get into some starting auto sieving and uh, moving into the new base. So let's see how it's all done and jump into the episode. Okay, let's get into this episode here. And uh, this guy actually has a tool we want. Uh, I've been sieving a lot, so I actually have a lot of diamonds, a lot of emeralds. So I want this tree uh, capitator. It is way overpowered. It is one of the uh, cool tools he sells. Uh, so... Yeah, we, we actually have a diamond sieves. But we, uh, yeah, as I keep saying we, uh, and there is a reason why, uh, came up with this circle pattern here for the main base. A uh, small little connection to what's left of the old base. Well, pretty much where we left it at the end of last episode. Uh, right now I'm waiting on ore to finish being processed here. Uh, just, just waiting a little bit to get that all done. And the reason why is I want to upgrade seven chest to a higher tier chest uh, using sophisticated sophisticated uh, storage. And to do that, um, a little bit of gold. Is that my only gold I have here? Uh, sadly, all of this stuff is like just clustered in bad spots. So we can get at least the first three started here. Just give me one second to take something here. All right. Have uh, the first three torches. We'll have to make uh, some more torches here. Let's do that. The remaining redstone torches. And we'll take it this, surround it with uh, that, and we get what is known as a basic two iron tier upgrade. Well, with this and gold wrapped around that, it becomes basic to gold tier, which we can get two of them done up. Uh, and so see here we can get three of them done up now and what we will do is come to one of these chests right click it and it gives us more storage space equivalent of uh, a, like a triple chest. So this is one that I want to get done because of uh, all the ores. Um, and yeah, it pretty much uh, it pretty much does not matter for the last one. Grab some more of this. I, I was processing up some gold. The, the wandering trader showed up. So I was like, I have to show you guys that. So 
All right. Now, with sophisticated uh, chess like this, we can add upgrades into this. Um, just at sophisticated. And some of the upgrades we want to uh, add to this is like we can do stack upgrades. Um, I think we can, yeah, we can go straight from uh, standard to iron and gold. I uh, would like to get some of the tier four ones, but that that'll be for later me to deal with. Uh, and also, see here, we've got that, got those. What was the other one that I wanted? There is a not crafting upgrade. Uh, compression upgrade. That's the one we want. And we feel we have any. Oh, Are we out of oak trees right now. Wow, we are officially out of oak. Good thing we have oak saplings. Maybe. Yeah, you, you already gave us the cool thing that we wanted from you. So, uh, see this? I, okay. Uh, we have already had our first death. We, we died, uh, last night while working. On the base. Um, yeah, we died last night working on the base. I, I did not have time to record it uh, when it happened, and I didn't think it was going to happen. What happened is uh, I was working over there, I uh, started to fall, I tried to come land in the water. And uh, yeah, I, I just died. Okay, so let's, let's show you guys the power of this thing. Notice how just one hit and it took it down. One hit. Why do we need the, uh... oh yeah. We're making some uh, upgrade bases, which requires five. So we'll go. Again. As simple as that. As simple as that, it actually n doesn't eat up our stamina anymore. And it is so super quick. I like it. I love it. It's better than my Iron Axe. Um, waiting on this to get done here. Balance. Get those done. Right, 
So we've got the three remaining ones, which is this one, this one, and this one. Now all of this stuff is upgraded. Which once we move over to the new base, I've got to figure out where I want these. So give me a few moments to get our initial storage on the new island done up. I will be right back. All right, we're back and um, yeah, we, we've upgraded the cobble gym and pretty much all of the storage over there broke down to two storage, well, three storages being used. That's it. Um, that's one great thing about the sophisticated storage chest. Uh, another thing is those crafting tables are over there. I need a crafting table over here, so I'm going to show you guys what I am going to use as a crafting table on a stick. I, I also, to make this, make the patterns here, the, the, the particular chiseled stone bricks right there. Um, trying to find which, where it is, here it is. The stone cutter on the stick. Stone cutter on a stick, you right click, put stone in here, you can get the uh, pattern that you want out on the right hand side as long as the stone cutter can make it. That that's stone cutter on a stick. Um oh also I want to we have two right there chest and home. Uh, on the server, we we took a vote. People wanted more s spots, and they agreed 10 was not too much and not too little. So we have the ability to use 10 of these. Uh, let me see here. What else do I need from over here? I would like this bed. I need this set up, so... Flash home chest where we'll put the bed. It, it's just going to make uh, getting around a bigger base easier. All right, so I'm going to pick up my alchemist stuff because we're going to get more into that. Hopefully. Here shortly. First few episodes, always the roughest. Because, like, just getting started. All right, and it's almost dark. So what I would like to get done today is take this one, automate uh, us getting the ores and stuff. Now to do that, I would like this compression upgrade, which we're going to need a couple of redstone, which is in here. And I'm not sure if I actually have enough materials to do this just yet, but... Oh, we're going to need two more. All right, so... 
this. We're going to need uh, two of those. We need some cobble to sleep through the night. Deal with this uh, wandering trader here in the morning. Let's see here. Anything useful from you? Sturdy beef cage. I will gladly take that sturdy bee cage. Because we'll, we'll get into bees. We will definitely get into bees. Um, okay, so this. We need two pistons. Uh, and some upgrade templates. So we're going to need I'm not sure how many upgrade templates this makes. I think it only makes one. Yeah, so it is costly. Make upgrade templates right now. Right now. Here, probably not too bad. So we get a compression upgrade. Uh, we also want to make the stack upgrades. The iron. More of the iron. Okay, here's the iron blocks that I had made. Um, Okay, so we've got this first tier stack upgrade. We want to also get a couple of stacks of gold. Do this, get a couple stacks. Should be able to do this now. We've got the gold one. And we'll come over here to this guy. See how there's stuff in here, the aluminum ore chunks, the diamonds here, the flint. Well, if we add this compression upgrade, one single slot can't be compressed from the previous slot. Don't get this. Okay, maybe it's not the compression upgrade, but we can add this and it does uh, say make stacks that are above 64. It allows us to have up to 512 uh, of an item in a stack. Not sure. Why that one does not work. Thought it was the compact. Oh. Oh, it's this one. It's the compression upgrade. Okay, so. That's a little bit down the road. And why why are you always raining? I okay, I don't get this upgrade. You can have that setting in there. Till I figure this one out. Alright, so we're gonna need to take uh, we're going to get some automation going here. Let's see if we got enough time and I will let you know. Okay. Uh, after waiting until it stops raining, we do actually have more than enough time. And, uh, what I want to do is set this chest here. 
Uh, this is a very early on sieve setup that we're going to do here. Um, so I would like to make the first sieve, uh, which we're going to require us to have uh, some of these iron bars. Okay, uh, hopper, plate, sieve. Okay, so we can make we make all three of these right now. No, because we don't have the hopper. Okay, there we go. All right, so we actually can make all three of the sieves. That's good. So we're gonna have uh, one sieve set here, like this one sieve set back here, like so, and one sieve set over here. And now to make sure that they interact uh, with this thing, we can, uh, I think it's right click. You see that blue triangle, that's the output. So like we can do that. Now we can see the triangle on the, the square on that side, not triangle. I know my shapes. And now they're all outputting to here. Okay, so now we're gonna need multiple flux hammers. I I literally mean we need multiple flux hammers. Uh I want to at least get the very first flux hammer done. And based upon what we have here, so to make the uh, flux hammers, we're going to need one key of hammers here, six hammers in total. Uh, and we're going to need glass, which I did not make glass before we moved over here. So I'm going to set you down here, give you your augment, get this coal generator right here. Uh, we'll have some coal in here. Blocks full. Here we go. Uh, I'm only going to take three of these. And I'm back into that. Get Balance that out, whatever that is. Uh, as sand. All right, so get our compressed hammer. Compressed hammer. Okay, we take the compressed hammer, toss uh, all the gravel that we just got done. Get some more compressed hammering done of this for sand. We will toss in two stacks of sand in here while we get, while we hopefully will get the, the stuff that we need. I did not realize how much glass we were going to need. I didn't realize we needed glass panes. Uh, but 
we need six hoppers. So why don't we make those while we're waiting? One, two, three, four, five, and six. in the last panes. Um, so now we make flux hammers. Get our first two of these guys done up. Get four more. Yeah, four more. Go stand on this real quick. So we should be able to do this now. Make some more glass panes. We need uh, three more blocks. Okay, so now. Make all of the flux hammers. We can actually make all the flux hammers. So that is good. Uh, we'll pick this up. We'll pick this up. Go over here, put away some stuff like this. And what we'll do is this guy gets set here like this. He has a proper output already going into this one. This guy will have uh, two like that. Uh, it will first turn gravel, then it will turn uh, stone into gravel, gravel into sand, sand into sieving. So we'll set up this guy like this. And this one will be the dust pattern. Okay. So we now need to power all of these guys. And I want to at least power um, everything right now on coal generator. And I do not have enough uh, cables to get the dust one done, started. Next, they need, uh, these sieves need diamond meshes. Okay. And you'll see this is working properly. This is working properly. These machines should also be working properly. And what I can do now is come over here, grab a few stacks of uh, cobble. Stick it into these guys. Here have, have uh, some cobble. And these will start sieving, and sieve materials will come over here. Uh, we're getting the sand out of this one, so yep, there we go. Getting sand from uh, the diamond stuff from sand as well, so. Uh, I do have to make some more of these power cables, like two more. 
And if I have to adjust uh, the, the meshes, I will between uh, episodes. So we'll stick sand in here. This dust into here. And make some more. Energy cables. Uh, where is one of the ore hammers? Should have some more hammers. There was there's one. Uh this. So we'll take this real quick. I uh, make two. Pieces of steel, which requires the iron dust. Get this guy on here, just as a temporary thing. Set this up in here. Once it starts getting power. Gotta have enough power to, to function. Give it a few moments. Uh, one of the things I wanna do for power is maybe switch us over to a solar, a passive power supply. Maybe solar, maybe wind. Oof, we're on our last piece of redstone, which getting that hooked up is going to be fantastic. Ooh, we're getting prismarine, charged service ports. We're getting a lot of good stuff here. Iron nuggets. All right, so... Once we set this up here, uh, we have this going, should be getting power out of energy. It is getting power, slow and steady. Okay, so it gets enough power. We're getting grains of infinity, which has Ender IO. For those that do not know, Ender IO is one of my favorite ones. We will probably be playing around with that. It's just, it's been a while, so. Uh, yep, uh, I think that is it for this episode. So if you like this episode, hit that like button. If you dislike this episode, go right ahead, dislike this episode. If you guys want to play on the server, check me out over on Twitch and uh, become a member over there uh, because members on from the Twitch have first priority. Join the Discord and we can get you all into this with us. So until next time, guys. Later, Gators.